What's up YouTube, Alex here, Inch95's channel, bringing you guys a video, haven't made one in a long time, this one's gonna be a short video on my part, cause the ending, I'm probably gonna add some endings, so uh, yeah, just uh, gotta, gotta do a lot of updates, a lot, a lot of updates, mainly a lot of shoutouts, so I'm just gonna hop straight into the shoutouts, uh, Shout out to Team Top Deckers. They're a new team. They help. Uh, I've checked out their channel. Fun channel. They they're gonna have a lot of new stuff coming up. Uh, next channel is Tylenol PM Jordan, one of my good friends. I I give him a shout out pretty much whenever now. Uh, Bella, whatever. Adam Bellaradsky, a friend of mine, he hit me up a, a day ago. Uh, actually, last like this morning, like at one in the morning, and he started his own channel. He used to do a couple videos for me on this channel, but. He's starting his own channel, so check it out. He has he's gonna have a lot of good stuff there. He only has like two videos, which is a deck profile and a video of Mark Garcia, um, the national champion in like oh six or oh seven for the US. Or uh or the top four. He top four. He went to Worlds. Uh he's he's topped several events. He's a really good player. He topped San Jose, he got second place at it. So he's a really good player. He's a good he's a personal friend of mine too. The TCG player. Which is um, the TCG player. Wow, I couldn't get that out. I'm sorry, I'm a little sick. Um, Josh Graham, really cool guy. I've known known him for a while too. He's a he's he knows a lot about he know, he has a lot of insight on the game. He's on Team Hunger Force with uh, Roy St. Clair and uh, wow, I'm blanking out. But he he's a good player. So check out uh, M Cool Forty, Robbie Cole. I've been talking to him a lot lately. He's, we're trying to work out a couple of deals and trades here or there. So uh, yeah, he's been real cool about it. Um, Pro Winston, Jarrell Winston, again, I've been talking to him, I saw a shout out to me, I was one of the seven people he shouted out, and, uh, I'm, I'm glad to hear that his mother got better, um, and I hope Mama, Mama Winston, <laughs> as everybody's apparently calling her, gets better, dude. Uh, the next few people I'm gonna shout out are just some people, I think it's like eight people or something, six, six or eight people, that, uh, shot, uh, that hooked me up on a couple comments with, uh, with comments regarding, uh, some of the family issues that I've had, and, uh, like financial issues that I had, um, as far as uh, personal stuff, um, and they commented on. I think it was my last video. I, was, I think it was like deck of the month, October two thousand ten. So I'll probably have the link to that here as well as the people's names. Um, S S Shape Snatch FTW for the win. Uh, two thousand two hundred twenty one thousand seven hundred R Mister YGO thirty Neos Protested Hero ten Turtle Hoop and Red Fox sixteen. Those are just. Uh, I think those are. Like half, not even half the people that that commented below, they were like, "Oh, I hope everything works out, dude." People supported me, so everybody was just really cool about it. Um, they understood. That's why I haven't really had a video in a, in like a week and a half, and I usually post a video like every three days. So uh, yeah, those are shoutouts to all those people. Um, probably uh, as far as other stuff, updates. I'm gonna be having a lot of new decks, um, updated decks. Uh, new stuff for sale, trade, um, you know, scraps, that new cutie stuff. Today's actually sneak peek, today's Saturday. Um, I'm probably not going to go today and tomorrow, actually. I'm having people go for me. Uh, yeah, that sounds kind of, that's kind of, that sounds kind of snobby, but, uh, yeah, I, ha I have to have pe people go for me because I'm busy this weekend and, uh, have a lot of work to do, like, um, for, for a couple things that I have to get taken care of. But, uh, yeah, uh, everything's going pretty well right now. Everything's getting better. Um, I'm at the end of this video, stuff that's been going on lately, um, I'm sure some of you guys find, know or have found out, I'm a die-hard, uh, Lakers fan, they're 6-0 and right now, 6-0, and La La Land, um, I went to the Kings game last week, um, got last minute really good tickets, got right behind the bench, and I don't know if some of you guys, some of you guys have my Facebook, some of you guys have, uh, my, uh, saw my YouTube, I'm probably gonna have the video at the end of this video, um, that I took, like, a couple, like, short clips, um, I literally, Kobe Bryant is by far my favorite sports player in history, other than, like, MJ, of course, but come on now, like, Kobe is just raw, I don't care what you say, we're going for a three-peat, and the, the saddest part, the reason why I haven't been making videos is I am de completely depressed because at the end, um, after the game, we were sitting right behind the Lakers bench, and I went up to where the players go in after Kobe got interviewed, he walked up, threw his tourist fans up, and I'm a little, kind of like a Yu-Gi-Oh, I'm a rarity whore, I'm a Kobe whore, so I literally, he threw both of his bracelets up, I was holding my camera in my right hand, caught him with my left hand, both his bracelets, or uh, wristbands or whatever they are, 
Um, I was crazy about that. Three seconds later, I get tackled by like a hundred drunk white guys and people wearing Lakers jerseys all over. People were insane. It was an amazing game. Um, but I got tackled. I literally felt like di I died every two minutes from then on up until today because I literally lost a souvenir of something that could have potentially made me money, but I probably would have kept it. So I've been depressed. That's probably why I haven't been making videos. A lot of people know about that. Um, yeah, I really wanted to get those bracelets. These two little kids picked them up, and it was really sad because they were wearing old school Kings Mike Bibby jersey for like a thousand billion years ago. Like, I don't even know who wears that anymore. So that was really pathetic. I, I'm, <laughs> just a short little story for you guys. So I'll probably have the video at the end of this video. So yeah, be sure to check that out. Hit me up. Um, I'll probably have more of this. So peace, and uh, be sure to comment, rate, subscribe, and check out a couple short clips. Of
number 15, DeMarcus Cousins. And number 19, Dano Gugu. And Sam Dallenberg and JT. Seven, four, eight, 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 e